Hello everyone, and welcome back to Alton Plays Earth Defense Force 4.1. Sorry about the little stutter there, I was just checking to make sure my microphone was on. It's on! Uh, hopefully you can hear me pretty well. Whew! So, I am uh, recording a little bit later than usual. <laughs> There's a very interesting story behind that. You see, I got a call at like 10 o'clock at night from my girlfriend because she likes to go on walks right around the town and she tells me that she's seen like this office chair that looks pretty good and it just someone just put it out on the corner someone just put out this perfectly good office chair and she's sort of like you know you can have we can take this home if you want to just drive down and take it you know if you want to and she's doing that thing where like she's like kind of I feel kind of guilty if I just say no this is stupid why do you want to do this <laughs> so I don't say that I drive down at 10 o'clock at night to go get this mystery chair and bring it home on my own because of course she wants to keep walking bring it all the way back up to my apartment put it in the bathroom so that we can clean it later and then okay so lo and behold like an hour later she goes into the bathroom to like do something I don't remember what take a shower that was it and she looks at the chair and she notices a bug on it well it turns out this chair is covered in bed bugs it's literally crawling in the little creepy motherfuckers and that's very portentous of like what we're gonna be doing <laughs> today because holy crap just I, I can't escape bugs today for some goddamn reason apparently you know Get bugs in real life, and then fucking bugs in video games. Alright, Mission 89. Star Eaters, EDF groups across the globe have perished. The only remaining force is on the aircraft carrier Destina. Despina? Despina. Without support or supplies, we don't have the power to continue the fight. But if we'll be dead tomorrow, then today we'll make our stand. We're going to attack the Earth Eaters with everything we've got. The last threads of humanity hanging in the balance. The difference in our fighting capacities is dramatic, and failure is almost assured. But we will not give up. Prepare for battle, you brave EDF soldiers. For your job, all you have yet to do. I salute you. Now go kill some bugs. Oh my god. I cannot fucking believe that we brought that fucking biological weapon into our house. As you can see, I came loaded for, um, Elephant. Shiza. Ah. Uh. Bring back the sky. So, yeah. I've had an interesting day. You know, this is on top of just like regular work and stuff, you know. It's the daily routine, going to work, doing some stuff at work, you know. Coming back home, doing fucking pickup and delivery for fucking bed bug bombs. Oh, jeez Louise. What hatch? There's many, many hatches. Mm. There are cannons under the earth eaters. First, destroy the cannons. Got him. The bombing is too much. First, destroy the cannon. Oh, by the way, I should have some uploads soon, or who knows, maybe I'll already have them up, of a live stream I did with a friend of mine. Uh, his real name is Pat, Patrick, but uh, his online name is uh, Morting Canyon, or Death Rabbit, apparently. Oh, shit. Shizzle. Get the hack out of hack out of my way. You gosh darn goober snoot. Fuck. 
fucking chair full of bed bugs. Oh my god. This is gonna have to be like cathartic. Almost. Oof. To destroy the brain, you need to attack it from the top. From the top? I can't attack it from the top. What is this bullshit? I can't attack it from the top. What? The top of the brain is being protected by the earth eaters. First, destroy the surrounding earth eaters in order to expose the brain. Alright. Destroy the red panel. What red panel? This one? The red panel can only be attacked Dang it. from directly below. Think of it as a target on the bottom of an upside down cup. What? What? The target at the bottom of an upside down cup? What kind of metaphor is that? Transmissions are being jammed by the Earth Eater's electronic interference, and there is no way for us to know the situation in other areas of the world. But. We are collecting as much information as we can. I feel itchy just thinking about those bed bugs. Sent throughout the world. Most major cities have been destroyed. But most people have left the major cities and survived. The resistance is continuing, and mankind has not given in to the ravagers. I would certainly hope not. Everyone listening to this broadcast, please survive. Please survive. survive no what. what a fucking piece of advice there. Don't die if you listen to this message. Don't get killed. I don't think the EDF is particularly... What hatch? What hatch? God damn it. I don't see no hatch. I don't see the hatch. There's a lot of these things around here. Hopefully we can actually kill all these things. They are greatly, greatly irritating. Oh, I think I just saw that cake shop again. Acid soda. Old staples. Apparently, like, Japan only has, like, 20 or so different... Ah, fuck you. 20 or so different, uh... Shops. Casual shop, Karen, sale, 60% off, what a bargain. What am I doing, wasting my time trying to save Earth when I could, instead, be uh, attempting to get some fucking t-shirts over. Oh shit, oh shit. This is annoying. Stop shooting at me. To attack the brain and mothership simultaneously. If the mothership comes on the scene, oh. finished. I think I see it. A way. There must be a way. Oh, I can actually hit the brain. I sh I should have realized that. But I didn't cuz I'm stupid. I'll search for weapons that can handle it. Brain is hit. Brain suffered damage. The brain suffered severe damage. I don't think so, man. Oh, this is not good. Uh. No! Oh, fuck. Yeah, no shit. That's what fucking enemies are. Yeah, easy for you to say. Fuck. Okay. 
Okay, that was not an important one. We got a lot of these fuckers to deal with. Where? Ah, a lot of these annoying things, and like, it's just not efficient to actually shoot them with my sniper rifle. It's actually more efficient to just kind of ignore them. Oh, that was a pleasant noise right in my ear. That's just what I want to hear when I fucking play this game. Hopefully these ones should actually open up soon, because... Damn. Oh, actually. Eat this. Uh-oh. Oh, fuck, fuck, fuck. Can I get some backup over here, or maybe just like some healing or something? Damn, oh man. Huh. Oh fuck, they destroyed it. Oh, you motherfucker. Try and shoot this thing. Seriously? Holy crap. Yeah. We done do it. Ha ha Um, what the fuck is that? What the hell are these things? Where the hell is that fucking health? Did I pick it up? Yeah, I did. Oh my god! Oh my... Oh, even more of these guys. Jesus Christ. I'm... <laughs> Look, guys, I'm seriously, like, using completely overpowered weapons, and even still. This is insane. I am destroying the brain. God damn it. God damn it, they're blocking my shots. Holy oh, shit, that's a much better reassuring explosion. <laughs> Holy crap. Uh-oh. Oh my god. That's a good idea. Holy shit. Get away from that thing before it explodes. I, I think I might have mentioned that I was doing some live streams, but then I probably trailed off because I was getting my ass handed to me by something. But yeah, um, I did some live streams with my friend, uh, Morden Cannon, or Morden Cannon, however you want to pronounce it. And that should actually be going up pretty soon, and it was lots, lots of fun. I'll be doing the highlights, but if you want to check out the VODs, uh, there should be a link to that in the highlights themselves. But anyway, is this the last mission? Who knows? Mission cleared. We've done it, guys. Good job. 
Holy shit, we did it! This is the end! The Ravager's brain stood strong behind its screen of defense. Fearlessly, the EDF infantry attacked from below. It was a terrible battle. Many brave men and women lost their lives, but one elite squad refused to yield. With the last of their strength, they dealt the brain a fatal blow. It's very difficult to keep up with this. It's going very fast. The brain fell to earth. Its impact caused great devastation. Oh. <laughs> the shockwave shattered the ground like glass, swallowing the attack team in the cloud of smoke. Nice. Many soldiers lost their lives in that impact, but humanity proved itself victorious. The Earth Eaters scattered, and the Ravagers and their minions fled the Earth. Finally, those monsters understood. You don't fuck with the EDF! Oh, the human race would not lie down and be conquered. <laughs> That's not quite what I would say. Just as our soldiers returned from that smoky battlefield, sorry, I'm turning into Sean Connery, so too has humanity rebuilt and recovered from our losses. Fucking sexy. Let future generations remember one thing above all. The triumphant term of our greatest heroes. Storm Team. <laughs> EDF. EDF. Japanese voice cast. Oh my god. <laughs> I mean, I guess it makes sense that they'd list the Japanese voice cast, even if, you know... We're not playing the Japanese game. I don't know if you guys actually want to watch the whole credit sequence. I mean, I guess we might as well. Artillery operator. Kazuyoshi Hayashi. Wing diver soldiers. Kayo Ishida. Miho uh, Suzuki. Mary Smizun. Fuck. I'm not going to embarrass myself trying to read these people's names. I'm too garbage even to read my own name. Names Atlon, the great and powerful. Yeah, see what I mean? <laughs> Man, it seems like they had like a lot of voice actors on this. Kind of surprising. They had like 20 voice actors <laughs> and like a dozen fucking like coders. And then, of course, another like dozen people on like, uh, Production, directors, voice directors, business managers, citizen, female C. Oh, English voice cast. Nice. You guys did a really good job, by the way. I think you did a fantastic job. I loved all the voice acting in this one. Oh, fuck. I did researcher O'Hara. Oh, fuck. I just missed it. Oh, well, I can see it in my own video, I guess. I always I was very curious to see who fake George Sakai was. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> Presented by D3 Publisher, 2016 Sandlot D3 Publisher. Thank you for playing. Well, thank me for playing and thank you guys for watching. Thank you so much if you've actually like watched through this whole series. I I really commend you. I mean, it is a lot of episodes. <laughs> like, it was... <laughs> it was a really long ride, but if you, like, watch every single episode that I've actually done on this thing, really, kudos to you. Actually, let me know in the comments if you did, because fucking hell, I gotta give you, I gotta give you credit, because that is insane. And thank you, thank you so much for, like, watching. And this, I think, believe it or not, short of, like... 30 minute long indie games, this is my first full let's play, finished. I've completed every mission in the single player. But I wanted to let you know that this isn't the end for me and Earth Defense Force 4.1 because I really love this game and so I'm actually going to be producing even more content with my friend I previously mentioned, uh, Patrick or Morden Kenny, and he... <laughs> We have got some pretty good live stream highlights already. I've already done two live streams with him at the time of this recording, which might change by the time this comes out. It probably will, because it's a lot of fun. So, you know, if you came here for Earth Defense Force 4.1, you should stay, because there's going to be even more great content. I mean, probably, if I'm being honest, better than the single-player campaign, because, I mean when you have other people to play with 
This game goes from a fucking 9 to an 11. <laughs> Believe me, it's going to be fantastic. But anyway, I just wanted to get that out there. So stay tuned. Watch for uh, live stream highlights coming up on my channel. Go check out Morden Kenyon on Twitch. I don't know if I mentioned the platform. That's probably pretty important. Yeah, Morden Kenyon, M O R D I N C A. No, it's not C. Okay. K A N I. -N. Sorry. Sorry, Magic. I failed you. Well, that's the end, guys. I can't say I'll see you on the next one because there is no more missions. I will see you in the next video, though. So, take care, guys. Bye-bye.